Yeah, hey everybody, welcome back to Mindful Marketplace. In this video, we're gonna really quickly look at this very cool new feature in Circle, the Circle Software as a Service community building platform. This new feature allows uh, administer, you know, it, it admins, people like you and I who are running these sorts of communities, to create a landing page which has this very curated content stream sort of uh, feel and aesthetic and gives your uh, community a more, you know, a more organized um, appeal by offering a stream of content that folks can see when they land on your page. This is actually what Circle has on their own uh, private community, as you can see here. And this is what you would see when you land on the when you on the home tab of your Circle. You can sort it by the you know newest activity popular activity there's this whole uh, sort of checklist thing over here on the right hand side uh, and this actually is somewhat similar to to, to what mighty networks do, does so if you've uh, built a platform using mighty networks they've they have this sort of get started checklist which i think has always been very cool i'm actually going to show you how to do this uh, on my own community because I haven't enabled it yet. Uh, I just actually got the email that this was enabled on our community today. So I'm going to show you how it's done so we can together see what this looks like and whether it's a good uh, choice for your community as well. So here is the administration area, the back end of our circle. And by default, this is toggled off. So I'm going to enable the, the home page. Again, you're going to go down to the landing page, which is right underneath Weekly Digest and right above Embed. I'm just going to toggle this on. Again, I've not yet done this, so you're going to see this pretty much as it appears in a uh, you know extemporaneous way. Trending topics. Let's call this five rather than ten. Default sort. Let's call it new activity rather than latest. I guess new activity is different than latest by dint of people are actually commenting or leaving feedback on it on a um, you know piece of content rather than just the content itself being the most recent in a chronological sense. This is where you would set the default page for existing members. So when folks come to your community or log in, what are they seeing first? And I think it's sensible to choose the home page rather than the individual spaces. And again, the same thing for new members, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Here is a um, show a welcome banner, which is also toggled off by default. But when you toggle this on, it gives you the ability of adding an image. Let's say we're going to add this one. And then we're going to add a title that says Uh, you know what, maybe I would put my our mission statement here. As you can see, my typing skills are not great. All right. Allow members to close the welcome banner. I don't know. Yes, I guess. Right? I mean, I don't really know what that does. But I can imagine what it does. But let's just leave that set there. Show a welcome banner. I thought that's what we just did. No? Let's see if there's any difference. Show a welcome banner. Greet your members with a welcome banner on the home page. Yes. Show a welcome banner, greet your members. I guess this is for logged out users. Oh, you can actually add a video here too, which is cool. I don't know that I like the fact that you have two different 
um, permutations of this because it's so somewhat unclear to me what is different, but maybe on further reading, I'll get it a little bit better than I do now. All right, so I guess I'm assuming that's for logged out users. Let's see if we can change that with a different picture, maybe. Okay, now I just want to see what this looks like. That's really the entire goal of this exercise. Let's go back to the community. And here you go. So I'm logged in. Here's that original big image, which is way too big. Obviously, it's too tall <laughs> and too high. Um, but nonetheless, welcome to our new community. And here is the uh, welcome message that I typed in. I'm going to imagine if I log out of this that I'm going to see a the second image that I inputted second. So here is some of the new activity. And again, this is just a test um, you know, stream of content. But it gives a really nice, I mean, this is way too tall, so it sort of obfuscates or, or obliterates is a better word, or uh, covers up what really should be the hero, uh, you know, text content. So this image really should be uh, less vertically oriented and more, you know, I, I would keep something probably this size or maybe let's say this size. So this is what folks would see. And then of course you have all the, you know, the new topics and all that other stuff. Let's log out and see what it looks like. Because I think that other image is going to show up in its place, and there, go, and there, indeed, it does. Right. So here is the second image that I added. This is what logged out users, as you can see here at the top. This is a logged out state. So this is what folks would see who were not yet members of our community, and um, you know, essentially, you could use an image or a video here that sells you and your community uh, to folks who are landing on your site. I think it's really a sweet setup. A pretty uh, dramatic improvement over the way things were just, you know, before on our community uh, relative to the circle setup. I know a lot of people have been sort of pressing them for this uh, landing page, um, you know, template. And I think it's well done. Um, and I'm actually excited to see some other folks uh, use this in cool and creative ways that really amp up engagement, activity, and interest in the various circle communities that are uh, out there in the wild in the world right now. Now, the other thing I'm going to cover in another video is using a um, card community landing page. So using the card platform to uh, build a really cool landing page for your community. We're doing that now for a couple uh, of our projects with a couple people that we're working with who are running circles. So if you're interested in seeing that, uh, I'll post that in our private community. Uh, you can also email me hi at mindfulmarketplace.com. If you're interested in that sort of landing page, I'll show you some examples of that uh, in the you know, in the live video for sure. And maybe if you're interested in having that done, uh, I have someone who's building those, who's a card a designer. Card is a landing page uh, design platform. That's really, really cool. So if you're interested in that, that's coming soon. I may or may not post that on YouTube, but it will certainly be in, in our private community. Okay, doke. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Oh, last thing. This is not yet publicly available this this new homepage so you're you're actually uh, you need to be in the beta to get this you need to apply to get access to this new homepage uh, designed you know this new homepage template uh, but simply you know if you sign up for circle simply there's a place on the community to ask for access and they pretty much give it to everybody it just takes a little bit of time for them to work their way through the list okay thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day